What exactly is ABC? Let's now outline the ABC treatment steps. First, educate the patient about the importance of oral health. Then, explain the ABC oral care protocol to the patient. ABC offers three protocols. Simple, moderate, and heavy. For simpler cases, we may ignore certain steps. For moderate to heavy calculus, we follow the heavy protocol, a complete 10-step protocol. Now let's delve into the specific procedures of ABC, 10-step protocol. Step one, diagnosis. Before the operation, ask patients about their medical history, whether their blood pressure and blood sugar are normal, whether they suffer from heart disease, asthma, blood type diseases, etc. Whether they are in their menstrual period, pregnancy, etc. Every clinical case requires diagnosis. The patient can see his or her teeth with the help of a mirror. Let the patient know about the health of his or her teeth. An intraoral camera can also be utilized to capture photos of the patient's intraoral issues and facilitate communication with the patient through a screen. Step 2. Biofilm Disclosing Using Biofilm Discloser to reveal biofilm is a crucial step in ABC treatment. It helps to identify oral health issues in patients, enhancing doctor-patient communication and trust. Apply the Biofilm Discloser to the tooth surface. After applying, wait 30 seconds and rinse. It is now possible to continue using the intraoral camera to capture photos of intraoral issues, display them on a screen, and explain them to the patient. Step 3. Super Jingable Airstream Use compressed air to drive powder mixed with water through an airstream device onto the tooth surface. This process removes biofilm, pigments, and soft deposits while polishing the tooth surfaces, restoring a bright and glossy appearance to the teeth. The powder can be selected according to the patient's oral conditions. During Airstream, pay attention that the angle between the nozzle and the tooth surface should be at about 30 degrees to 60 degrees. The labiobuccal angle is approximately 30 degrees. The distance between the nozzle and the tooth surface is 3 to 5 millimeters. Conduct airstreams from the gingival margin to the incisal end of teeth in a spiral circular motion. The strong suction head follows the handpiece nozzle. Prevent powder from spraying onto the mucosa. Gauze can be used to cover the tongue and soft tissue when you operate alone. When cleaning the lingual and palatal sides, adjust the nozzle angle to 60 degrees. Tilt the nozzle outward to avoid powder spraying on the gums or use a mouth mirror to shield. Step 4. Super Jingable Ultrasonic Scaling after Airstream, we can perform ultrasonic scaling using titanium alloy tips to remove residual superjingable calculus. Choose the right tip according to the patient's oral conditions. Locate and remove calculus in the patient's mouth. Subgingival Ultrasonic Scaling
According to the actual situation, clean the areas in the mouth where there is calculus, as not all areas need cleaning. If the patient has sucking gyval calculus, it can be removed using sucking gyval ultrasonic scaling. Step 6. Superjingable Airstream If necessary, we need to perform shallow superjingable airstreams to remove biofilms more precisely. At this time, a glycine powder is used. The amino acids in the powder can also nourish your gums and prevent gingival recession. During operation, aim the nozzle at a 90-degree angle to spray between the gingival margin and the teeth. Use the circular motion for cleaning. Step 7. Sucking Gyval Airstream In this step, you can use 14 micrometers erythritol powder or 25 micrometers glycine powder to remove sucking gyval biofilm. In periodontal pockets deeper than 4 millimeters, which also helps to nourish the gums with amino acids. Step 8. Dental Tubules Sealing After cleaning, we recommend using remineralizing toothpaste to prevent cavities and enhance tooth hardness. Plus, polishing can make the tooth surface smoother and reduce biofilm adhesion. When operating, make the Profi Angle Cup fit the tooth surface and apply gentle pressure. Step 9. Oral Spa Before the procedure begins, prepare an eye massager or a steamed eye mask for the patient. First, massage the gums inside the mouth. In the video, the action of each part is only demonstrated once, and in the actual process, each action needs to be done at least three times. After the oral gingival massage is finished, the operator needs to change new gloves and then perform facial acupressure. Prepare a warm towel. Before starting, let the patient feel the temperature of the warm towel. Place the warm towel over the salivary glands and masseter muscles of the jaw. At this time, the position of compression is the salivary glands of the jaw. Warm compress relaxation. In the video, the action of each part is only demonstrated once, and in the actual process, each action needs to be done at least three times. Step 10. Recall. It is essential to stress patients the importance of proper brushing and regular maintenance. Usually the recommended recall interval is three or four months. ABC represents a typical shift in oral care, guaranteeing prevention and comfort with efficiency.